Hi geeks, welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing the trailer reaction for Beauty and the Beast. This is a teaser trailer and it is 1 minute 30 seconds. And from what I've seen from thumbnails and that, it doesn't have a lot in it, but I've heard that it has some great visuals. Um, so what, I'm, what am I expecting from the trailer? Well, I was expecting just to see like the dress or the beast and i don't think we get to see them in this trailer well at least i don't think we do anyway okay so no more talking let's just watch the trailer because i'm really really excited for this i like how they use a castle to incorporate the disney logo i was having to do that and i already just started to feel like the original i think they're showing it over time what's happened at the castle and it's a beast oh is that bell oh la mia and the clock oh that's nice that's really really nice Oh. There's Emma Watson. Oh, this looks great. Be our guest. That's so far away. But given that trailer, I think it's going to be worth it. I really do. Because that looked really, really good. Just by the teaser trailer, it looked really really good i know they didn't really show that much in the trailer but that's what they do for like most of their teaser trailers with alice in wonderland maleficent and pete's dragon they don't really show that much it does get you excited and i love the disney teaser trailers maleficent being one of my favorite i think I, that was really really good that was probably the best one i've seen in a while but i mean they could have gone the cinderella out where it was just a slip the first teaser trailer was just a slipper well like rotating around in a slipper then the butterfly comes on to become part of the slipper um, they could have done that with the rose here, but no, they didn't. They gave us some great visuals. We also hear the voices of Lumiere and Cogsworth. I do wish we have seen a little bit more, but then again, this is a teaser trailer. They just want to tease you with the movie when the first official trailer comes out. That's when we're going to see, you know, the Beast, Gaston, the dress, you know, all those other things. And um, Miss Potts and stuff like that. And what also was interesting is that she used an English accent, her own accent, and not an American accent like it was in the original. And I haven't seen Perks of Warflower and I've seen bits of it, but I think she's okay with American accent, but it's better if she did with an english accent also i don't know if emma watson can sing i mean i hope she i, ho I hope she can i don't know if they're going to auto tune her voice but uh, i'm really excited to see her you know singing that is this trailer has actually made me want to watch the original a lot i mean i've already seen it i've seen it a few years ago uh for the first well not for the first time but like for the first time that i remember if you know what i mean but yeah this is such a beautiful teaser trailer and i really really can't wait for the movie such great visuals so I'm really excited for this movie. I was excited before it, even the teaser trailer came out. I think it looks really, really good. I do hope that we get like a first official pick or something of Belle or Gaston or one of them even because I just, I really want to see more of this movie and I think it's definitely going to deliver. But just given by this teaser trailer, it looks so, so good. So if you've seen Beauty and the Beast teaser trailer, tell me what you thought of it down below. I will leave a link in the description if you haven't seen it. And do you think they showed not too much or just enough to get you excited for the movie? Let me know down below. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Don't forget to click that subscribe button for more trailer reviews and movie reviews thank you so much for watching bye